Good evening on this uh, Labor Day. It's 1030 in the evening. Uh, you're looking at the water vapor imagery. Here's Portland. And what I want you to notice is this uh, circulation right here. This is the upper level low that at one time, going back five days or so, the forecast charts had moving inland on Labor Day. But look how it's held out to sea. That's why we basically stayed dry. Same story tomorrow. Rain chance looks slight. But on Thursday, this low should finally push inland. And that will bring us likely rain finally so Tuesday forecast models tonight like a little dab of rain in the morning may or may not happen otherwise look for a partly cloudy sky day kind of like Labor Day was but uh, with an ongoing chance of rain and temperatures getting close or maybe reaching 80 degrees Wednesday rain chance is not zero but it looks like a dry day partly cloudy 82 is that low still sets offshore then Thursday let's assume that that low finally shifts inland that would bring us uh, maybe a couple shots of where it's raining steadily over a large area for a couple of hours. Two-day rain totals, I think Thursday and Friday, still could exceed a half of an inch. Um, Friday, scattered showers might, might decrease later in the day, uh, but it could be Friday overnight before that low pulls up to the north and gets out of here. Saturday morning could start with some clouds, then it clears, and then once that happens Saturday, we are off and running with a sunny, clear, north to northeast wind, uh, warm weather pattern all the way to the mid part of next week with temperatures most days in the mid-80s or warmer. Mm. All right. Have a great back-to-work Tuesday, and I'll talk to you soon.